Senator Bernard. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Well, I must say it's difficult to come after these last two in particular, <laughs> and I know we're near the end. So, honorable senators, it is actually with heavy heart that I rise today to pay tribute to the honorable Senator Bovey. Senator Bovey and I were appointed to the Senate at the same time, and all along I have appreciated her unwavering support, her dedication to issues of equity and inclusion, her allyship, and most importantly, her friendship. As grandmothers and seat mates, we have developed an even stronger bond, sharing stories and, yes, laughter. Her sense of humor is infectious. Her dedication to the arts and her leadership has brought more of an appreciation of diversity in art to this place. I have also learned much about the politics of the art world. <laughs> <laughs> and there she's laughing. <laughs> in honor of her retirement, I am going to recite a poem written by our mutual friend, the former parliamentary poet laureate, Dr. George Eliot Clark, Africadian artist extraordinaire. Mm. I pray I do justice to it. It's titled, A Portrait of Honorable Patricia Bovey, Senator. Senator Bovey is poised to retire from this red chamber, site of Les Beaux-Arts d'Adaba. So let Yusuf Karsh inspire this sketch, Kiarusha, show of a star. Her eye is keen, a Claire Weissman weeks lens, Perspective upon perspective aligns, accurate with what perception contends, spot on with what examination finds. Like Emily Carr, she is totemic, as blunt as black, as plain as white, and though never purple in sculpted polemic, always takes she first place the best in show. She scrutinizes every masterpiece of legislation, takes the big picture to tease technique from technicalities, to tell cracks from fine lines and crack cool liqueur. When the Honorable Senator leaves this chamber, practically her second home, I will be just one of her peers who grieves or faints, succumbing to Stendhal syndrome, astonished by art without an equal, enthralled by an artist without sequel. Mm. Senator Be Bovey, we wish you the very best as you move on to your next chapter.